Yes, sir, we back at the Sports Kickback League 2024. We're at the Douglas Community Association in Kalamazoo, Michigan for this live contest and game of the week of Sports Kickback Heat versus the Sports Kickback Pistons. Shit, we're ready to live up for to get a good game with the 2023 Sports Kickback Champions, formerly known as the Lakers. And right now, I want you to hit that like button, subscribe, hit the notification bell, because we about to turn it up. Right now, at the tip off. Lante, he has the ball. He dribbles up the court with a dribble handoff to Cam Fuller. CJ with the corner three, and it's no good. Got Terry on dribbling the ball up the court, the number three, seventh grader in the state of Michigan, and he's scrambling for the ball. He's pushing, whoa, look like a little foul. Push it off to Claw Ryan. Claw Ryan's a tough point guard. From Lennon Grove, he's in the eighth grade. He dishes it down low for the layup. The referee calls change on possession. And right now we have Terrell Robinson bringing it up. CJ with another jumper, is it? Good? And it's air ball. Mello with the rebound and he outlets it quick out there to his point guard, in which it is lost. Oh, foul on the play. James Ray, shout out to James Ray. James Ray is a consistent referee in the sports kickback league, and we salute him. So we got the ball out. Claw Ryan passing the ball in. All right, we got a timeout on the play. Since we're going to our timeout, let's give a big shout out to our sponsors. Big shout out to Premier Athletics for Youth Development. A big contributor to the Sports Kickback League 2024. And while you at it, check out their new AAU tournaments being located here in Kalamazoo, Michigan, being played at Western Michigan University and K College. And make sure you check out the meet and greet this weekend at Main Street Pub. Main Street Pub. Main Street Pub this weekend. Not rewind it so you can see the flyer again for all the info. And we're going to get back into it. This is a good matchup. Uh, both teams got uh, eighth graders on their team. A couple key players earlier in the week. We had the number one overall pick, Ben Vari from Ben Harbor, Michigan, traded to the Heat. All right, we got Ace passing it in to Terion. Terion has the ball. He dishes it back out to Claw Ryan. Claude breaks him down with the tween tween with the pull up, and it's no good. Rebounded by Lante. Lante, he pushes up the court, he slows it up. She give it to Terrell. Terrell is eyeing him up, he gives it to Cam. Cam sizes him up, he tweens between the leg, grab by the arm. He goes in, and it's a foul on the play. Cam Fuller is a tough, physical Small four point guard, they pass it in to Terrell for the three. And it's no good. And it's rebounded by Claude Ryan. Claude is trapped. He passed the ball up court to Terrion. Terrion dribbles the ball up. He passed to Melo for the three. And it's no good. And it's rebounded by the Pistons. Monte dribbles up the court in traffic for the layup. And it's no good. And it's rebounded by Miss Colbert. And it is good for the two pointer. She is solid out here. Oh, the press. The Pistons. Oh, Terion breaks the press. He comes down with the and one. And one finish by Terion Pratt. He is very physical right now. He's rated as the number three seventh grader in the state of Michigan by T3 TV. And Buckeye Preps along with us, Sports Kickback. Whoa, 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 what we got going on here? We got a lane violation going going the other way. Pisses ball. Are right, we going to figure this out? All right, let's go. All right, the ball is passed in to Terrell. 
Terion sits down in his defensive stand and he passes it to Lante. Lante, he passed it back up top and he passes it to Cam. Cam with the three, no good. Rebounded by CJ, back up with it and it's good. I'm sorry, that wasn't. Was that TJ? Couldn't even see it from our angle. We got Claude dribbling the ball up the court. He's tweening. He passes it to Melo. Melo drives to the basket. He has the little fadeaway leaner, and it's no good. And it's out of bounds. And it's staying here. Juwan Gilmer, he passes the ball in. And it's back out to Claw Ryan. Claw Ryan tweens, tweens, tweens. And he goes to the cup with the floater, and it's good. That is a nice tween and layup. Can you stop? Twill Robinson, he dribbles the ball up the court. He's looking for somebody to pass to. He passes to CJ on the right wing. CJ drives to the hole, and it's a foul on the play. This game is going to get real physical. Both of these teams are rated as the number one and number two team in 2024 for 7th and 8th grade. And right now we have Ben Bari coming to sit in on the bench. He's, he's a big pickup for the Miami Heat. And the first free throw is no good by CJ. Free throws is the key part of the game. Anybody knocks down the second one. Claw brings the ball up the court. Claw is a very smart point guard. He passes to Jawan to the corner to Braylon. Braylon, he's trapped. He's trapped by Lante. Lante gets the steal. He pushes up the court. Passes to Terrell. Terrell puts up a floater. No good. Rebounded by Melo and it's tipped. Braylon grabs the ball and he retreats. Pass to Terry on Terry on pass to Claw Ryan. Yeah, I don't know if that was a pass or a loose ball. Braylon, he's trapped again in the corner and it's out of bounds. For these teams to be this good, for it to be four to five with two minutes left in the first quarter, that means it's a lot of defense being played. I like that play right there with the steal by Lante. Lante dribbles up the court. He passes it to the corner. Oh, and it's stolen again. It's a lot of defense being played. Terriani dribbles down the court. He disses it off to Baby Ace. Baby Ace, no good. Rebounded by Claw Ryan. Claw passes up for Ben Vary, the number one overall pick this year, and it's good. He is a nice pickup for the Heat. The Celtics. They wanted to get younger, so they got rid of him. Candy dribbles off the court. He's dribbling through everybody, and it's stolen. No, it's back, and it's, oh, and it's a foul on the play. I really like this Colbert girl. His, her, her mom, Denise Colbert, she was a nice basketball player in her high school days, and I see the apple didn't fall too far from the tree because her daughter is a monster. Dribbles the ball. Shoots the first free throw off the backboard and it's good. She's very, very physical, guys. Shoots the ball off the backboard and good. Is that something that she practices two in a row? I take it. All right, presses on. And very has the ball. He passes to Terion. Terion, he passes it back around the claw. They reset it for the pick. Pick and pop. He passes it down to Melo. Melo drives again. He disses out to Baby Ace. Baby Ace for the three. And it's no good. And it's rebounded again by Melo. Melo is playing strong and physical right now. What we got on the play. And this is a packed crowd for the first game of the Sports Kickback League. And for the last things of the first quarter, Terry off with the three, and it's no good. At the end of the first, it's a tight one with a lot of defense. Seven to seven. Miami Heat versus. It, you're so used to saying Miami Heat. It's not even Miami. It's really sports kickback heat. <laughs> 
versus the Sports Kickback Pistons. Yes, sir. And we're going to get right back into it for the start of the second quarter. With the Pistons ball, baby Ace putting pressure. He passes it up to Xavier Coffey. Xavier Coffey goes to the corner and he dishes it down. Oh. Yes, sir. He gets back on defense. Ben Very, he dishes out to the corner to Baby Ace. Oh, and Baby Ace steps out on the corner. With this new beautiful court, you probably didn't even see the line. The floor is sparkling so hard in the Douglas Community Association today. Cam, he dribbles up the court, dribbling through traffic, and he goes to the hole like a Big Mac truck. Good finish, Cam Fuller. Cam Fuller is also one of the top eighth graders in the state of Michigan. Claw Ryan, he dribbles up the court. He passed to Melo. Melo for another three, and it's no good. And it's rebounded by Ben Vari, and it's a foul on the play. This kid, Ben Vari, was very active at our first open gym. He wowed everybody how he came in with his athletic ability and only being a seventh grader. And he's close to like six foot one, six foot, maybe even six two, depending on what shoes he got on. And the first free throw is no good. Ben Harbor had a lot of talent too in our high school level this past year. Uh, was undefeated for most of the year and, and did pretty good in the tournament. And the second free throw is good by Ben Vari. And the ball is passed in to Cam. Cam Fuller, he dribbles down the court with his left hand. And he's trapped by Baby Ace and Terry on. And he disses it all the way to the corner to Duders. He passed the ball back to Cam. Xavier in the corner, he goes to the hole with a floater and it's no good. And it's rebounded by Big Zay and it's back up with Big Zay. And it's no good. And it's pushed up. And it pushed up to Baby Ace with the move. Oh my God. Oh, with the layup. Oh my God. It's a show in the gym tonight. It is a show. And Cam is going to get back. He comes back up the court. He's dribbling hard to the hole. And it's tipped. And it's rebounded by Dylan Pitts, but it's knocked out of bounds. Oh my God. That was a great pump fake by little Ace Will Height, a seventh grader from Portage Middle School. The ball is passed in the can. Cam is going to play very aggressive with the step back jumper. It is good. Right now it's five minutes and 30 seconds left. Pistons up one, 11 to 10. Ball is passed to Terion. Terion pulls up the shot and is tipped. All right, we're bringing the ball back up to court. Xavier has the ball. He's dribbling through everybody. He comes up for another floater and it's no good. And it's rebounded by Claude. Claude is off to the races. He is running. He's running with a fillet. Nice layup, Claude Ryan. And he's getting back on defense. The ball is passed to Duder. Duder pass to Dalen Pitts. Dalen with the extra pass. And it's stolen by Ace Will Height. Ace is pushing it up the floor. And it's stolen back by Cam. I told you guys, it's a lot of defense being played in the Douglas Community Association. And we have a timeout by the Pistons. This game is very aggressive. Coach Shepard, he wants to sit back and talk to his Pistons. Tell him to slow it down with the ball. But right now, we are about to get into another commercial break.
and shout out to again to our to our sponsors at Premier Athletics. We're about to get started again. The score right now is the Heat 12, the Pistons 11. And we pass the ball in with four minutes and 35 seconds left. Terrell, he comes up the court. He's dribbling. He passes it to the corner. And he passes it down low to Miss Colbert again. And she finishes again. She is such a solid player. Oh, my God. I just imagine what she's doing to the girl. Ace, he dribbles the balls up. And it's tipped out of bounds. Stay the heat ball. Claw Ryan, he passed it in. He's also a quarterback for his middle school, Linden Grove. Ace, he passed to the corner to Jawan Gilmer. Jawan misses, and Cammy's pushing the ball. Stolen by Terry on again. He passes up again to Claw Ryan for another layup. This game is very intense on the defense with a lot of pressure. Maybe Ace pushing Terrell, and Terrell loses the ball, and they're scrambling for it. Pass the ball up to Cam. Cam sizes up, been very for the three, and it's no good. And it's rebounded by the Colbert girl again as she finishes. She is so solid. Baby Ace, he brings the ball up the court. He's dribbling. Ace will height. He's dribbling through traffic. He swings it again to Ben Vari for the three, and it's no good. Oh, and he's out hustled. Oh, and it's rebounded again by the Colbert. That's what we're going to call her, the Colbert. Terrell for the three, and it's no good. Rebounded again. Oh, Ben Vari out hustles the Pistons. He passed to Terrion. Terrion is dribbling through traffic again, and it's a foul on the play. When you got a lot of defense going on, you're going to have a lot of fouls. A lot of defense, a lot of fouls. Right. So we have the ball passed in to Skyler. Skyler with the easy lay with a lefty. Xavier, he has the ball. He dribbles up. Courtney loses it. It's going back to the heat. Baby AC gets the ball. He dribbles up. Sides up the defense with the screen for Melo with the pull up from Baby Ace. No good. It's rebounded by Scholar. Push back out to Claw Ryan. Claw goes in with the fillet. Oh my God. Oh baby. Terrell. He has the ball. He's trapped again. Terrell dribbles through practice. He loses the ball. And it's staying here with the Pistons. That was a nice layup by Claw Ryan. Lante, he passes the ball in. He tries to pass it down low, but it's stolen by Melo. And it's stolen back by Lante. Oh, Lante misses the layup. He gets it back out to Rail. He's back to the corner to Lante for the three. And it's no good. And it is out of bounds. The heat ball. Ace Will, how he passes it in to Skyler. Skyler looks to pass it up court and it's stolen. A lot of defense, like I said. And the layup and it's no good by Terrell. Rebounded by Lante and it's no good. Rebounded by Ben Vari and he's pushing it up the court. And he pushes it, he loses the ball. He reverses it back out to Ace. Ace swings to Skyler. Back down the claw for the baby fadeaway, and it's no good. And it's rebounded by Terrell. Terrell Robinson, and he stopped in his tracks. Cam has the ball again. He's dribbling up the court. He's very aggressive. He goes to the hole, and the lefty finish, and it's good. Baby Ace resets it again up top, and he comes up for a quick pull up three, and it's off. Rebounded by Cam. Cam's dribbling through traffic again. Oh, and it's the end of the quarter. All right, now it's halftime with the game. 
The Heat leading 18, Pistons 17. I know these coaches are going to talk more about offense because we've been seeing a lot of defense. Take a break. Community Association, Premier Athletic for Youth Development, and another new sponsor that we have in partnership with Boys and Girls Club of Kalamazoo. Without you guys, Sports Kickback will be nothing. All right, we're getting back into the tip-off. James Ray passed the ball down. And a new thing that we added this year is youth student referees. I think it's pretty cool that we can show these guys that you can make an extra living, extra cash on the weekend and being available to teach former and new sports kickback league athletes. So the ball is back in. Still a lot of defense being played. Terion takes to the hole with a reverse layup, and it's no good. Rebounded by Melo again. Melo goes back up, and he misses the layup. Cammy has the ball, and he's dribbling through traffic. He passes up to Terrell. Terrell tries to tip it out, and it's blocked. Terion is pushing up gas, and he passes out to Claw. Claw for the easy layup. Terrell has the ball at the half court line. He passes to Cam. Cam sizes up Braylon. And he has the ball. He passes to Lante. Lante with the shot blocked by Claw Ryan. He's out hustling everybody. Terion passes up court to Baby Ace. Back to Claw. And it's stolen again by CJ. CJ passes it up to Lante for the layup. Oh my God. Are they okay? That is a big crash in traffic. Jeez, so Pete. Someone please call 911. Yeah, I wonder if y'all really like my commentating voice. I'm just out here having fun with these kids. So much talent out here on this floor, man. The first free throw is good by Lante. Lante with his second attempt at the free throw line. And it's no good. And it's rebounded by Terion. Terion pushes the ball to the court. Try to dribble through traffic. No call on the play. Rebounded by Melo again. Passed out to Claw for the three. And it's no good. Passed up court by Cam. And it's saved by Terrell. Terrell passed to CJ for a three. No good. And it's rebounded again by Claw Ryan. Claw dribbling the ball up the court. He's getting hassled by CJ. Terion has the ball. He's trapped. Claw passes it down to Melo again. 
Melo loses the ball to Cam. A lot of fumbling of the ball right now. First game of the season. They're, they're going to be kind of rusty. Cam comes through with the floater, and it's no good. And it's rebounded by the Colbert. And it's blocked. Shame on you for blocking her shot. Go oh, foul on the play. I take that back. Foul. She's playing so aggressive. I, I would have rewarded her with the foul too, James. She's at the free throw line again. She shoots, and the first one is no good. We got a mass substitution coming in for the Pistons and for the Heat. We have little Tony coming in. We've been hearing the crowd screaming his name, and again, the number one overall pick that was recently traded earlier last night. The Cobra for another free throw, and it's no good. She gets her own rebound. She shoots it back up. And it's no good. And it's rebounded by Baby Ace. Baby Ace has the ball and he's pushing it. He pushes it to the corner to Lil Tony. Lil Tony passes it to Claw. Back up to Baby Ace and he swings it again. And that's Terion with the three. Number three. Seventh grader in the state of Michigan. Cam, he's dribbling the ball. It's almost a one-man team at this point. He takes it to the hole, and he misses. Rebounded by Terry. He passes up to Claw. Claw with another fast break layup. I think we need to give him a fast break badge, and we have another timeout by the Pistons just to slow down the heat because they are heating up. It's always great to see these kids out here expanding playing early in the week in sports kickback league and later on in the week playing their AAU games it's always a beautiful thing definitely want to give a shout out to the whole Douglas staff to Miss Ledbetter to some Sonetta Moore to Mr. Tony to all the custodians little Tony Billy little Billy <laughs> we really thank you guys for being a big support of the Sports Kickback League 2024. And we're coming back in from a timeout. Right now the score is 25 to 18, Heat leading. Coach Black is feeling real confident right now on what, what his Heat is doing. The ball is back in play. They pass to Xavier. Xavier pushes down low to Dalen Pitts. Dalen Pitts step back for a layup, and he passes it out. Oh, my God. It's rebounded by Ben Barry. Then it's passed up the court to Terry on, and it's another turnover. we got to take those shots that's given to us. Well, what's going on here? Was there a call and no call? It was halfway defense? Okay, I guess it was a call. James Ray, he resets the play. All right, Duda passes it in to Xavier. Xavier, he dribbles up the court, and he's pressed up by Claw Ryan, but he gets behind him. And he goes to the hole with the floater, and it's no good. And it's rebounded again by Benvari. Benvari, he's pushing it up the court. He's not slowing down with the layup, and it's good. 27 to 18 Miami. Well, sports kickback heat, they lead. Cam, he goes down to the hole with the floater off the backboard and is good. Baby AC dribbles the ball. Been very for the three in the corner and is good. They actually play AAU together, so they have that connection between Baby Ace and Ben Vari. Cam, he dribbles the ball up the court. He's dribbling through traffic again with another floater. And it's a foul on the play. This game is very physical right now. Cam is also a standout running back at Maple Street Middle School and located in Kalamazoo. And it's also a standout in basketball, as you can see. The first free throw is good. We have a sub on the on the court. Baby Ace out. Jawan Gilmer in. 
And the second free throw is no good. And it's rebounded by Terrion. Terrion probably passed to the corner to Skyler. Skyler reverses back out. Passed up to Terrion. And they're just swinging the ball back to Ben Berry. And, oh, and it's another three. Great ball movement. Oh, and it's out of bounds. Off the leg. Oh, my. You get down by a couple points and, you know, you start getting frustrated. Those little plays start happening. And we want to slow it up because the Heat just tried to heat it up and get the ball going again after the turnover. Right now we have Claw Ryan passing the ball in. He passes it in and it's blocked by Big Zay. Terrell, he pushes the ball. Trying to break this lead down a little bit more. He passes to take Xavier. Xavier with the floater and is good. Now it is 33-23. The Heat lead. Terrion is pushing the ball. He gives it to Claw with the fake pump fake. And he passes out to the corner to Jawan. Jawan with the jumper and is good. Three ball by Jawan. And it's passed. A lot of defense being played. Very physical. Claw with a lot of pressure. And it's a foul on the play. A little bit too much pressure. Kind of hard to teach the young guys defense. Everybody wants to be the scorer. And they pass it down low. And Dylan Pumpfake. And it's blocked by Ben Very. And hustle on again. Xavier pass down low. It is blocked by Skyler. Oh my God. It's a block party right now in the Douglas Community Association. Oh my God. And that's the end of the quarter. The Heat are very hype right now. Oh my God. These girls on these teams are ballers. I love seeing these guys play. Hopefully, in the near future, we can get a sports kickback league for girls. That would be nice. And all right, we're back in the play. Two girls chatting it up. <laughs> all right, ball's back in. Terrell brings the ball up the court. 35-23, beginning of the quarter. Lante's dribbling through traffic still. A lot of swarming defense. But it's a foul on the play. Oh, jump ball. I'm sorry. Jump ball. The heat ball. Claw passed the ball into Terion. Terion passes back to Claw. Looks like they're wasting time. Waiting for him to come play defense. Juwan with another shot in the corner, and it's no good. Rebounded by Terion. Terion with another shot, too. And it's missed. Nice hustle. Another rebound by Cam. Cam slows the ball up. He dribbles. He tweens. He's looking for a shot. Foul on the floor. This was a great game in the lead blow, blew the lead open with multiple threes. Having a shooting clinic right now. Monte passed the ball in to Terrell. Terrell loses the ball. Belante is hustling and it's out of bounds. Claw Ryan controls the offense again. Look like they're still killing time, and he passed the baby ace to the corner back to baby ace. And they're just killing time. They're just going to get out of here. His teammates tell him, tell CJ to step up to get the five count. Terry on in the corner. Still dribbling the ball. Tween, tween. He's going to the hole. He's going. Oh. And he stopped by Lante with a fade, and it's no good. And it's rebounded by Cam again. Cam goes to the hole strong. No foul on the play. Terriani pushes behind the back. He passed the claw. 
Paul loses the handle back to Baby Ace, and it's blocked by Terrell. And it's tipped again. A lot of defense being played, with the score being 35 to 20, 35 to 23. The Heat lead by 12 with five minutes and 15 seconds left. Terrell. I'm sorry, Lante dribbles the ball up the court and he dishes off to CJ for the tip and it's no good. Dished out to Baby Ace. Baby Ace passes back up. Oh, and it's a good move. Oh, great move, Claw. Claw is in his bag tonight. How deep is the bag, Claw? Cam is looking like a one-man army dribbling through traps and presses and he goes back up with a shot. And it swing, swung out. CJ has the ball with another shot and it's no good. And it's rebounded by Terrell. And it's a foul on the play. Terrell will be going to shoot two. Terrell Robinson is another basketball standout, football standout at Maple Middle School. Definitely looking forward to what these fellas do in high school next year. First free throw is good. Terrell with another free throw and it's no good. And it's rebounded by Terrell with a fillet. And it's good. Oh, my God. He might need to pull off the highlights. And it's pass to the corner to Ben Vari for another three. And it's no good. And it's rebounded by Ben. He's hustling. He's hustling. No foul on the play. And it's rebounded by the Colbert. Cam is dribbling through everybody. He goes to the hole. And he distances off to CJ. CJ with the easy layup. Right now the score is 37 and 28 with three minutes and 24 seconds left in the game. Miami Heat call the timeout. It's kind of hard not to say Miami Heat, but it's the sports kickback heat and they call the timeout. Coach Black wants to chop it up with the young fellas. Tell them to slow it down. There's no rush. We're up by nine with three minutes left. Let's get out of this game and go home and get some snacks because we can't eat in the gym. That's one of the new Douglas rules. No eating in the gym, ladies and gents. All right, we're coming back into play. Great day of highlights in basketball and a lot of defense. That's all you can ask for. Great basketball by these 7th and 8th graders. Mello, he passes it in. It swung back to Mello after a few passes, and he goes to the hole and he finishes. CJ, he passed the ball up to Lante, and Lante loses the ball out of bounds. Heat ball again. Coming up with three minutes left in the game. Baby Ace is trapped and he still passes it off to Melo. Melo, he goes to the hole and he loses it. Terrell with the ball. Terrell is going in traffic. He goes in for the layup and he doesn't make it. And it's a tussle and it's a jump ball on the play. And it's the heat ball on this possession. Sorry, it's the pissing ball on this possession. All right, we're back. We're back with one minute left. Baby Ace is up top, up top again. And he dishes it out to Terrion. They're just swinging the ball around. I think they're just trying to get out of here at this point. He's trapped. We have another game of the week coming up. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. We got the Knicks. And the Jazz coming up next. Make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell for the next game of the week being dropped by Sports Kickback. Claw Ryan, he passes it to Terion. Terion to Mello back up top. 
And he swings it to Baby Ace. He's just playing keep away, just trying to kill clock. Coming up on 30 seconds left. And they're swinging the ball. What a great game. And another layup because they fell asleep on defense. Claw killed everybody on the layup. I think every one of his shots today was a layup. Cam dribbles the ball up. Looking to get another bucket. Ah, and the layup is no good. What a great game for the first game of Sports Kickback Season 2. We want to thank everybody that stayed with us throughout the whole video to watch. Right now, player of the game, Claw Ryan with 13 points. Also, Ben Vari with 14 points. The number one overall pick from this year. In the play of the game, we got to give it to Ace Wheel Height with the pump fake and the layup. What a great layup, great move. And you know Cam had to come back with his strong physical layup. I would have gave him an and one on that play. Great layup, Cam. Thank you guys again for tuning in with Sports Kickback Season 2. It was a pleasure having you guys listen to my raspy voice all night. And again, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. Hit the like button. And we are out. Thank you to Douglas. Thank you to Premier. Thank you to the Boys and Girls Club. We couldn't have did this without you. And until the next time, Coach Mister, I'm out. Sports kickback. back.